have Albuquerque. We're going to try to hit Albuquerque, New Mexico today. So we got about 13 or 14 hours. So Hello and welcome to my channel, Boo Snakes and More. For more videos like this, also watch my other half channel, a and Snakes and Stuff, my youngest son's channel, Henny's Toys and Games, or my oldest son's channel, Little Chris 10. Today we're going to be talking about the Affordable Connectivity Act. So please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Now let's dive in. The Affordable Connectivity Program provides 23 million low-income households $30 each month to help afford broadband service. <laughs> Galesburg, Illinois, 23 million Americans may soon not be able to afford internet access in their home if the Affordable Connectivity Program expires at the end of April. The ACP provides low-income households $30 each week to help afford broadband service. Unless Congress passes billions of dollars before the end of the month to continue funding the program, those households may not be able to afford internet access. Illinois 17th District Republican Eric Sorensen, a Democrat, hosted a roundtable discussion at Cara Sandberg College Friday, April 4th. The congressman talked with internet providers and community leaders about solutions if the ACP is not extended. This isn't a red problem. It's not a blue problem. This is a problem that exists in every district, Sorensen said. More households participate in the ACP than the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program. Advocates said internet access is improbative for students completing homework, people working from home, and anyone simply wanting to communicate with others. Everybody needs connectivity to the internet today, Swarthen said, plain and simple. The congressman shared multiple stories from residents in the 17th district. One of them was from a woman in Galesburg. Sharon Swarthen shared that at the ACP ends. The resident said she would no longer have contact with people outside of her home. The Federal Communications Commission, which oversees the ACP, has already issued guidance to broadband providers on notifying recipients that they could lose their internet service. Thank you for watching this video and peace out till the next one.